For today's lesson, you'll need your water bottle and some space to move around in safely. Stomp your feet to the beat. Stomp your feet. Stomp your left foot Stomp your right foot Stomp both feet Now stop, spin around Say yeah, yeah Wave your arms To the beat Wave your arms Wave your left arm Wave your right arm Wave both arms Now stop, spin around Say yeah, yeah Stop your feet To the beat Stop your feet Stomp your left foot Stomp your right foot Stomp both feet Now stop, spin around Say yeah, yeah Wave your arms To the beat Wave your arms Wave your left arm Wave your right arm Wave both arms Now stop, spin around Say yeah and bow For this week's riddle, see if you can guess this sound. The answer will come at the end of class. All right, it's time for some jump rope. Pick up your imaginary jump rope. Mine is blue. And what we're gonna do is bring the jump rope behind us and bring it in front of us. Do this, bring it behind you, bring it in front of you. Remember, we're just pretending behind and in front. I wonder what color your jump rope is. Now, I'm gonna hold the jump rope, both handles in one hand. I'm gonna spin my jump rope in a circle. See if you can spin your jump rope in a circle. Let's try the other hand. Hold both handles and spin that rope. Oh, let's try a lasso. Over the top of our head, spin your rope. Very good. Now we're gonna do some jump rope rhymes. So get ready to jump with me and sing the rhyme if you know it. Here we go. Chickity, chickity, chop. How many times before I stop? One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Good job. Take a big snake breath in through the nose. Out like a snake. All right, let's try a different rhyme. Here we go. Candy, candy in the dish. How many pieces do you wish? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Whoa, good job. Big breath. Snake. All right, let's do another rhyme. My mother made a chocolate cake. How many eggs did it take? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Whoa, good job. Let's take another snake breath. And let's do another rhyme. Here we go. My sister dressed in pink washed all the dishes in the sink. How many dishes did she break? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Fifteen dishes! Oh man, take a snake breath. All right, here we go. Here comes teacher yelling. Wonder what I got in spelling. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. I got nineteen in spelling. I did great. All right, a big snake breath. Good job. All right, get some water. This week's food rule is to help pack your own lunch. Whether you're going to school or staying at home, I want you to start helping to prepare your own lunches. Ask your parents and caregivers if you can help to make your own lunch. Remember, when we make our lunches from home, it equals a home run. All right, it's time to play aviators. We're going to pretend like we're airplanes. Everyone lay on your belly and listen when the control tower says, aviators, you are clear for takeoff. You're going to press yourself up into a high plank and then you're going to take off flying like this. Everyone fly around, fly, fly, fly. Spread those wings and listen when the control tower says, Aviators, there has been a report of a hurricane. We need you to land safely. Then you're going to land safely on your belly. And then wait for the control tower to say, Aviators, the weather is clear. You are clear for takeoff. And now we fly. Aviators, this is Control Tower. We have a report of a hurricane. We need you to make a safe landing. Nice work. Aviators, this is Control Tower. You're clear for takeoff.
Aviators, this is Control Tower. We have reports of a thunderstorm. Please make a landing. Aviators, this is Control Tower. Weather is clear. You are clear for takeoff. Aviators, this is Control Tower. We have a report of some flying ducks in your area. Please land safely. Aviators, this is Control Tower. The ducks are clear. You are clear for takeoff. Aviators, this is Control Tower. There is a big dust storm in your area. Please land safely. Aviators, this is Control Tower. You are clear for takeoff. We're going to be a real fast plane this time. Aviators, this is Control Tower. There are reports of some flying Captain Underpants. Please land safely. Awesome job! Do you ever feel sad? Well, I'm gonna share something with you that helps me when I feel sad. Let's sit like a butterfly and I want you to use your hands and I want you to find your bones that are just underneath your neck. These are called your collarbones and, and feel around. And then once you find those bones, I want you to start patting those bones just like me and close your eyes. And when we pat this area, it can really help us to deal with our sadness. I like to take some big deep breaths while I'm doing this. Doesn't that feel good? Ah, nice job. All right, this week's brain tattoo is you can do amazing things. Isn't it amazing that someone invented an airplane? Something that we can get into and then fly in the air from one state to another state or even from one country to another country? It's pretty amazing. And just like the people who invented the airplane, you can do amazing things too. For this week's journal prompt, I wanna know, have you ever had the opportunity to fly in a real airplane? If so, what was it like? Where did you go? What was some of the best parts of your experience flying? If you haven't flown in an airplane, I want you to tell me a story about a possible future plane ride and make up a story about all the amazing, interesting things you're gonna see on your trip. All right, let's listen to the sound one more time. Do you know what this is? It's an airplane taking off. All right, I'll see you next week for episode 26.